Hey Daniel, Nick from ND Industrial Surplus. Hey, I here with your scale conveyor system. Um, have the display just mounted here temporarily. Um, what I want to do is just show the function of the um, way conveyor. Um, it's been calibrated and is uh, certified by Mettler Toledo as far as weight is concerned. Um, what I would like to do is I really want an idea of how you want the controls to work because it will require a little bit of wiring and hardware changes for me um, pending on what you want. Um, originally the way it was set up with the 483 phase motor was that a product was dumped into this conveyor and likely moved back and forth the feeder moved back and forth and when a set weight was on the conveyor bed this flap would open uh, it's actually open now but it'd be shut and it would run the conveyor and uh, just for the timer until the conveyor was empty and then start over um, what i really want to know is if you're just loading in this end do you want this to have a vfd hooked up so that you can adjust the speed or do you just want this gate shut and have this belt running full speed and just have it pile up your product from the gate, which would be shut, and just pile your product back up until the weight is met and then the gate will open and empty off? That's what I'm really trying to understand. And the second piece I, I would, would like to understand is your feed going into this conveyor. Um, how are you going to stop it from feeding once this scale is full? So if you're dumping product on and this scale is full, how are you going to stop the feed coming into it? A few of those questions would help me to set this up and add the necessary controls so that uh, you end up getting what you want at the end. Um, I hope that makes sense. Um, Otherwise, currently, if I hook it up the way it is now, this belt's just going to run full speed all the time, and then this gate is just going to open when it sees your desired weight, and then it's going to close after a couple seconds when it's, it's empty. But if you're still feeding the whole time and you're not stopping your infeed, that's not going to quite work for you. So... We can work around that. I just got to know what you want because it's going to require me doing some wiring and changes, which I'm more than happy to do. Just don't want to do uh, all that work and set it up in a, 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 you know, a configuration that isn't at all what you're anticipating. So, so the big questions are, do you want the conveyor speed adjustable? Are you going to stop and turn off your infeed onto the conveyor? and how do you want the, the flap to actuate. So just, just a few little questions there would help me to get this thing set up so that when it hits your floor, you only have to put, do some minor changes to what weights you want it uh, and uh, it'll uh, operate more closely to what you're looking for for your product. So hope that helps. Feel free to give me a call back. Have a good day, I appreciate it. But again, the scale portion is up and running um, it's pretty decent recovery time um, yeah let me know what you think thank you bye